At HashiCorp, we have this opportunity to be a generation-defining company, and, and so our opportunity is nothing less than serving the needs of the global 5,000 as they adopt cloud. You know, we know that when you swipe your credit card, when you process a transaction, when you turn on that webcam, that that goes through our products. That's what we do every day. That's satisfying to us. That's what we get up each and every day to, to pursue. So the shift to cloud is basically about the, the delivery of net new things that enable the digital interactions that we all have with the world. The fundamental paradigms of infrastructure, security, and networking are just different because they're running outside of the data center. As the world sort of accepts that cloud is the new place where applications are going to run, it causes actually the entire software stack to be reconsidered. That's our opportunity. Our opportunity is to be the enabler quietly in the background of every company in the world that's running cloud infrastructure. Working at HashiCorp, you get to work on the vanguard of distributed systems, literally the most sophisticated of environments on the planet. We have customers that run 17, 18, 20,000 servers in a single estate, all connected, running, orchestrated through our tech. That's just a really intellectually interesting part of the market if you like working in infrastructure. We have committed ourselves to being a multi-product company. Odds are that if you're interested in, in a particular element of infrastructure, we probably have a product in our pipeline that's addressing that cloud challenge. If you're interested in engaging with a particular customer segment on the go-to-market side, the odds are that we're addressing that challenge and we have that opportunity. I would describe the culture as a reflection of our principles that we publicly articulate. We are eyes wide open that software companies' chief and really only asset is its people. And while we often say that in industries, the reality is we are aligned around a common idea and the only inputs to our, to our products are people typing behind text editor and compiling that into machine instructions. So literally the only constraint is our own imagination in terms of what we can pursue. And I think given the, the reality of the market transition, the scale of what's happening in the cloud and the ability to sort of pursue that in the world of distributed systems, I cannot think of a more interesting place to be.